And with the ID Tech X show. Hi. Uh, hello. So who are you? Um, uh, so I'm Jussi Kasni calling uh, from uh, Finland. Greetings to Danish people out there. So and we're from Suunto, from Finnish company manufacturing world's best dive computers and sports watches. And we're also rolling out a moves and sensor, which is a programmable sensor platform capable of doing nine axis IMU acceleration, gyroscope, magnetometer, and there's also single channel ECG, heart rate measurement capability, and so on. And what's cool about it, we offer a software tool so that anyone can program their own algorithms and make the sensor to the flips and twists that are required in the particular use case. Maybe it's a motion sensing capability that you're after, or maybe it's a single channel ECG measurement capability. And our, our business is, is selling and offering these sensors to the cool projects and uh, this allows innovators get their products out to the market in really fast manner without investing huge amount of money in the hardware development. And as an example, we have a MoveSense showcase application here. I'm now recording uh, ECG with my with my patch electrode sensor. You can see there's a one, one channel ECG which is visible. Then I can turn on the uh, acceleration signal if I move back and forth you can see the acceleration data or get the gyroscope signal from here which is measuring rotational velocity and this idea is that innovators out there they can tailor the functionality of the sensor to suit their needs in whatever the use case might be in their mind and this sensor is available in quantities from one to millions and if you go to moveses.com or moveses shop here, here's a secret code that you can use to get, get the uh, IDT special discount for ordering developer kit, which is uh, available in the Moosen store. So this is a small device with a battery? Yeah, it's housing a coin cell battery in 2025 20, size, and it lasts in a heart rate monitoring use case roughly 400 to 500 hours. And of course, depending on what your algorithms are doing, if they're counting, calculating prime numbers or mining bitcoins, the battery lifetime could be shorter, but uh, Usually, uh, people are doing a lot of optimizations, and we can see reach really good lifetimes in, in a whole bunch of use cases. So, this one does ECG. Yeah, it does How? one one channel ECG. There, there are these snap electrodes in the back that are used as the ECG uh, connection point. Then there is a chest strap where you snap the sensor like this and ordinary heart rate monitoring chest strap. We also have a proof of concept glue-on ECG electrodes you can stick to your chest and measure without having any uh, strap around your chest area. But these are available for, as a proof of concept uh, for, for getting an idea, but usually uh, most of our customers are using this chest strap based uh, ECG measurement capability. Same single channel is that good enough, or single channel is good enough? Good channel enough for or? for getting an idea of whether things are in good shape or what's going on. But of course, uh, if more thorough analysis is needed, then multi-channel uh, uh, signals giving better idea where the where the signal fluctuations are coming coming from. But for example, it related to arrhythmia detection and these kind of use cases, single channel is more than adequate. So there's lots of other stuff you said though, that's happening in the little, this little device. So you got a really good uh, chipset in there. Yeah, there's doing some excellent good stuff, chipset, right? and we have excellent and really clever engineers behind developing this whole thing. That's that's the that's the secret source that we're utilizing, and we have squeezed. We have been able to squeeze a lot of technology into the really small package and this is still waterproof and every single device is measured at the manufacturing line to 30 meters of waterproofness. Do you talk about what chipset or? Yeah, the, the, the Bluetooth radio is from Nordic Semiconductors, our lovely friends from Norway. And, uh, not very far, right? Not, too, not very far, not very far. And, and then, then, uh, then you have good PCB in the whole system? Yeah, good PCB and then, then it's crucial to have really, really good expertise in low power electronics design. And here's an example of external temperature sensor if you want to measure temperature of some very small places where, uh, and get the really good accurate readings. Uh, maybe some electronics or maybe from human beings or maybe some animal health or so. This is also something that we're, we're now manufacturing and starting to ramp up. And we also 
in the process of uh, ramping up a medical variant showing this little ECG QRS symbol here. This is a medical uh, variant of the same sensor having a clinical quality ECG for applications that are requiring that kind of a full ECG spectrum measurement. So you have many different yeah, the idea, the, the platform is the same, that these are examples of some customer projects uh, who have implemented something yeah, utilizing the sensor, sensor technology we're yeah, offering. There's a way to connect yeah, in there to add million. different things. Uh, sorry, what was the question? There's a way to connect to your system, your connectors, or yeah, to that, add different external things? Yeah, we, we are provi providing some APIs for uh, hooking up external sensors, but then of course, there's this always this mechanical sensor. You you can hook it up to a to a wall and measure a local temperature. Maybe if you want to measure the uh, tennis racket motions, you can also use this as a as a mechanical connecting point and hook it up to your sports gear and see what's happening. Maybe it's your mountain bike that you glue it on and then you're going downhill and measure the the shakes and ups and downs. Or maybe it's your ski or ski boot that you could hook this up to and measure the. Uh, motion of this of the gear during your run. So it's available. People can buy. It's available at moveses.com/shop, and the moveses.com is housing a plenty of additional information on the capabilities and possibilities. And moveses.com/shop has developer kits, and there's a secret code that is only valid for duration of the IDT TechX show, as giving a good discount on uh, developer kits, and uh, it, it's giving a rock and roll start to the experiments in the sensing world. It's a good price to get these. It's it's very good price. It's 99 euros minus minus this extra discount. Give it a shot.